Hey everyone, welcome back. This is Dan from DHTV, and today I'm going to be showing you how to install iPad OS 16 and iPad OS 16.1. Let's get started. All right, so before we begin updating to iPad OS 16.1, there are a few things you need to have set up first. You wanna make sure you have a charger on hand and you have at least 50% battery or more. If you don't, plug it to the charger. You also wanna make sure that you are connected to a fast, consistent Wi-Fi connection. Otherwise, it's going to take longer or it may fail altogether. Next, you need about four to five gigabytes of storage. So you're gonna open your settings, tap general, tap iPad storage, and you wanna see how much space you have remaining and available. If you don't have enough space, you're gonna to have to remove apps, photos, videos, all that stuff. And then lastly, I strongly recommend you back up your device beforehand. It is optional, but if something goes wrong, that's the only way you'll be able to get your information back. Once you have that all prepared, open up your settings application, tap on the general tab here, and then tap on software update. It'll search for the update for about a second and you should see download and install. Now, not all iPads are supported. So there's a link in the video description that'll tell you which iPads support iOS 16 and 16.1 and which don't. So we're gonna tap on that. It's gonna prompt you to enter in your passcode. So just enter that in. Tap agree to the terms and service and agree again. And now it's gonna go through the updating process. It starts with the update requested, then it's gonna go through the download. During this time, you can use your iPad, but you wanna make sure that you return here at some point to continue the installation. So my estimated time is about seven minutes. So I'll fast forward to when it's done and I'll let you know how long it took. All right, so once the update is complete, you should be brought to a page like this. You can tap install now. And it took me about eight to 10 minutes for my update. Now, during the installation time, you don't wanna to touch the iPad, let it do its thing. If you have it plugged to a charger, don't unplug it, don't power it down, don't start playing around with it, just let it do its thing, be patient. And you'll notice that it'll turn on and off throughout. Don't worry about that, that's just how it's going to be. And we'll come back when it's done. All right, so the iPad is back, we have installed it, and we're just going to swipe up here from this screen. It took about five, 10 minutes. For that installation, enter in your passcode and we'll tap continue. Face ID here, we're gonna set that up later. We'll set up Apple Pay later. And I'm not going to share my analytics with Apple. We'll tap get started. And this is iOS 16.1. We'll just quickly check in the settings here, go to software update, and you can see iPad OS 16.1. Very similar to the iOS 16.1, but you're gonna get a whole ton of great features specifically built for the iPad here. So definitely stay tuned to the channel if you're looking to learn more. But if this video helped you, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and click the bell notification box to be notified when I post new videos. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.